Derp. Let's see. If that, well, yeah. What did I do wrong? Um, just a moment. I have no idea. That's okay. Um, I do have one idea. I'm going to delete it and try again. Where is my microphone? In my sources somewhere. Thank you, honey. Loves her. That's okay. Um. Okay. Uh. Um, do 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 do. I don't know if anybody's here. Is anyone here? Does anybody love me? Uh, oh, this is what I get for not streaming forever. Hmm. I'm gonna try something. Oh, hold on. I'm, hello? You can hear me a little better. Okay, I'm gonna try something, so hold please. Mm -hmm. Um Um, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out how to like delete it and then add it back on and I can't figure it out. Let me try this. Uh, okay. Did I add a second one? Do, do, do. I have no idea. Not a clue. Can you hear me at all? If not, I don't know what to do. I'm. You can hear me better. Okay. So maybe I don't have to reinstall things. I don't want to. All right, so I'm gonna try something. I want you to listen to me now and tell me if you hear anything different when you hear me now. Do you hear me differently now that you see my face? Do you hear me differently or is this just the same? Did I get louder? Okay, same, all right. Well then that, that tells me something. I don't know. I guess you guys are just gonna have to be bored with not hearing me well. I asked Mustache Man what color I should do next, and he said brown. I was like, that's super not helpful. Like, brown should be the next color I should do. Purple. I... I did a purple. I guess I could do another purple. Um, I could do a Quinn Violet. We'll do this one. Ooh. 
Although I think that one I didn't knock on violet. Maybe. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um. Oh, I did not do dioxazine purple. That's the one. That's the. Yeah, look at it. Ooh, ah. Uh, now that, that is purple. Okay. Alright. Yeah, that's, that's purple. Although I don't think it shows up on my, uh, like, for you guys on the same color. I don't know. I always wonder how much different um, things look on the screen. Like if my color balance is decent. needs to be more okay there we go so the goal is to have the kids do the left most part of the gemstone the darkest then the middle obviously is the middle tone and then the last one is supposed to be just barely there. Very pastel. Now this project was originally designed... This is not my idea. I totally got it from somewhere. But the original project was written for second grade. And... Though I think my second graders could totally do this, I don't. I don't know that my fourth graders can. My second graders, I feel like they are, like, the bomb. They will listen. They actually follow directions. They want to do work. My fourth graders, well, they're nine-year-olds, so. They're not worried about anything that has to do with school, really. They're worried about their Roblox accounts. Mom, were you able to get out of your neighborhood okay with um, with the roads? Oh wait, did you? Yeah. My sister had to work today, right? Were you able to get her okay? You took her to work? Okay. But were the roads okay? Like, were they slippery? Were they treacherous? Just challenging. Okay. Because she said she wants to hang out tomorrow. But, and I feel kind of bad, but I had to say, like, it depends on the the roads because we don't get we don't get plowed just like you guys don't get plowed so we are so low on the totem pole because we don't we don't even have this the city doesn't even do ours 
They have a private contractor, but let's just say it's not a priority. Ever. Eat. Okay. Um, I don't want to try doing a green. Can I do green gold? I can do azo green. Rows are better now. Astro oh, cool. <clears throat> well, I'm glad the roads are a little better now. I mean, I am not willing to leave my house right now. Because I don't know what it's like out there. As soon as they called a calamity day, I went right back to bed. I know. But uh, I've been there. Well, those days of Blockbuster when I had to go anywhere, even if it was like, you might die getting to work. But by God, people need their video rentals. Blockbuster needed that dough. They needed that cheddar. Because they were tanking. Is it bad that I think like 25% of the reason I went into be to teaching was so that I could have calamity days? I mean, I'm not saying all of it. But there's a good chunk of like crap that I will deal with because I know that if the roads are really bad I won't have school and I still get paid for it And that probably should, you know, I probably should be more worried about that, but I'm not. Like, there's no guilt here. No guilt. It's the amount of years that I drove to work in not good weather conditions just so that people could have their stupid candles or their stupid videos. Risking my butt. And the amount of freaking holidays that we had to reschedule because of my dumb work schedule. I'm glad you guys made it, like, made it okay. Um, I have no warm colors. I mean, this is kind of a warm, it's more pink than red. Do I want to add warm colors? Hmm. Oh, I know which one. I know which one I try. Did I get paint all over that? Hmm. Let's try cobalt teal. Next quest is bungee to go. Hmm. Hmm. So many things can be said. So many things. I apologize in advance. Because <coughs> that. That's, that's going to be, um, so much, so much fun 
for you for y'all um I mean I I I'm sorry I get to go to my other school because my stuff is all at my other school because we were supposed to have school today and uh, I left all my computer there and everything and yeah it's all, it's all over there so I get to go at the butt crack of dawn pick all that up on my way to work and eh, whatever it's fine my big adventure tomorrow is to check that my tire is not flat because it keeps doing, like, the sensor keeps popping on. Saying that it's low. And I will put air in it. And then it gets cold again. And it goes back down again. So I don't know if my tire has a slow leak. Or if it's just the tire is not happy about it being so cold. I don't know. But, like, right now I have to get gas. And check the tire pressure. <clears throat> you know, add add air. And <clears throat> I'm not doing any of that today. Well, by who? Like, the person who would be adding the air is me. Hey, Emma. How are you, Emma? How are things? The pupper is not a huge fan, but she has fur. So, she has that going for her. I do not have fur, so I am not walking her as much right now. Mustache Give Man is walking her. Oh, I'm sorry. That sucks. I mean, I'm glad you're getting over it. Burp. All of us are finally negative. Good. It frustrates me that it's still out there. It's still a problem. Just took Luca out in the snow. Aw. Did Luca enjoy it? Or was it like, Mimi, why are you taking me outside? Take me back inside now. Gracie keeps tripping over her sweater. <laughs> so I, I, and her sweater's just a little, t it's too big. It stretches out, it's a sweater. You enjoyed the fluffy snow compared to the harder, icier snow the other day. Oh, yeah, fair. Um, so... Her current sweater, it's a very much a sweater, so it stretches. So, um, he actually walked in this stuff. Oh, and because it's a sweater, it stretches, and so she'll roll around in it, like in the house, enough that it gets so big that she kind of like it, it just like it, it becomes a sweater dress, <laughs> and then she has trouble, like getting up because her legs are caught in a sweater dress um so i actually went ahead and i ordered her a doggy sweatshirt that's in her size that isn't as stretchy so that maybe she'll be able to wear that instead i felt kind of silly doing it because i was like i'm spending money on dog sweatshirts had him in his harness and when i brought him in the harness was off he ate the snow that i tried to do yep that sounds about right That tracks. <laughs> what kind of dog is Luca again? I can't remember. What breed? Luca's cat. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. That that's um now hilarious.
Because here I'm picturing him being like a, you know, a, some sort of schnauzer. No, no. Luke is a cat. He went walking as a tuxedo cat. Because that's how he does. That's funny. You take your cat walking? In this weather? You are. Well, your weather might not be as bad as mine. I don't remember where you're located. Because we are pretty much snowed in. Not that the city is snowed in. My neighborhood is snowed in. Because the city does not plow us. And it's not the highest priority, apparently, for our, our landlords. It's like, ah, they're fine. They'll just slide around a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, Gracie gets to actually go walking. Still working on the harness training? Yeah, that um, sounds super, super fun. So now I put, I know I put no face cam, but instead you just get my face in printed version. Oh, hold on, I'll look at that in a second. I gotta finish this crystal. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, that might be too dark. Now to assault it. Alright, let's see. He wasn't out long, didn't want him to get too cold on his butt. Yeah. Oh, Sweet bean. If I thought Gracie would actually wear booties, I'd get them for her, but I don't think she'd wear them. I think she'd be like, what the hell is this? Surprised he stood and actually took a few steps. Oh, He's probably sitting there the whole time going, what fresh hell is this, man? Oh, thank you. I am working on a example for my fourth graders. Because they're going to start doing these... They're going to start studying an artist named Lorna Simpson. And because she is... Wait, is this... No, this is not my fourth graders. This is my fifth graders. I lied. Ooh, sorry. Fifth graders. Because everybody else is doing like something to do with hearts. And I was like, eh, I don't think they want to do... I don't think I want to do anything with hearts with my fifth graders. Because... I want to do something different. Oh. The harness makes him act crippled. Yeah, but it, it, that's not unusual. Because it messes with their sense of balance. Somehow. Mm. So, yeah. Fifth grade is going to do this. Fourth grade is going to do a uh, heart for with uh, inspired by the artist Jim Dine. Because he is an artist from Ohio. 
And in fourth grade, they study Ohio history. Oh my goodness. Thank you for the follow, Urban Etiquette. Did I say that right? Though that was... Sorry, but that was a little... That was a little loud for me. I'm gonna turn that volume down real quick. Hopefully you can still hear me, because that was... Woo! Woo! Welcome in, Urban Etiquette. Um... So yeah, my fifth graders are going to do this. Fourth graders are going to do Jim Dine Hearts. I don't remember what third grade's doing. Uh, maybe it was a Romero Brito? Excuse me. I should look. Uh-oh. I'm sorry. Get it over here. Um... Uh, where is it? Mm. No. Mm. Uh. Okay, here we go. My third graders are going to do an optical illusion heart. Which I could probably do an example for today. Second grade is doing hearts based on, oh, what is her name? Psh, 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 Jen Stark. Second graders are going to do Chris Uphughes hearts. And kindergarten is going to do Love Prince. So, we'll see. Okay, so I have two more to do. What color should I make these? This one, this one, this one, this one. This one. Mm. I have like almost two of uh, every like cool colors. So I've got two of the pinkish, two purple, two teal, two blue, two green. Now well, three green. Mm. Um, what say you, chat? Hmm. Why is this the hardest part of my drawing? Um, let me see, what does... I don't know what this looks like. Sure. Why not? I think I already did it, but whatever. Another one of those greens is next to the red. This one? The top one? Yeah, okay. Let's see. Well, this one is quinacridone violet. This is M. Graham, which behave a smidge different than Daniel Smith. Of course, my students aren't going to get to use fancy paints, but I don't care. I wanted to paint fancy. Then I don't have the same liquid watercolors that they have at school. I don't have them at home. I'd argue I think those are actually brighter than my M. Graham. I should probably check this week to, next week to make sure that I actually have enough to do this project. Because I don't know if I do.
I do really like this purple because it, it tends to um, granulate. Even though a lot of M gram colors don't granulate. Granulate? Granulate. This one does. That kind of separates more into like blue and some kind of red. Bleep. Okay. Oh, you know what I want to do? I'm going to do like super. I'm going to do permanent. Uh, permanent green. Permanent pale green. Which is this one. Oh, I didn't think so much when I was drawing this one that I would have to paint it. Otherwise, I don't think I would have made this so skinny. Actually, I know I wouldn't have made it so skinny. So, does anybody have any amazing recipes for soup when it's cold like this outside that they like to make? Goop, goop, goop. Mm. There. Okay. Salt it. A salt. Um. Boop. That makes awesome homemade chicken noodle soup. Oh. I was thinking about potato soup, but I don't know if I have, I think I have the ingredients, but I am not about to go out to the store. No, no, no. Okay. All right. So I got to let this dry. Um... I don't think I'm gonna do anything in the background. I think I'm gonna leave the background. Oh man! I'm just gonna leave the background white. And I still don't necessarily like this transition. Okay, so when this is dry, maybe I can. This is inspired by an artist named Lorna Simpson. Um, she was the first 
black female to have a solo exhibition at MoMA in the, I want to say the 60s, but I could be wrong. 60s or 70s. Um, but she recently did a cover of Essence, I want to say, with a picture of Rihanna with diamond encrusted jewels as hair. And she likes to um, play around with showing the importance of the of hair in the African American community, and how it becomes a sense a source of um, a source of identity. Okay, I like it with the black crayon better. Do -do -do. Or I could even. Darken that up. Ooh, now I'm just getting fancy. How about I not do this until it's dry? How's that sound? Derp. I think I can go back in with color pencil. Oh, I gotta figure out what I want to show them, kind of thing, you know? Because they have the attention span of gnats. Mm, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna blow dry this for a minute. So I'm gonna be, hold on, I'm gonna mute myself. Nope, too aggressive. Too aggressive at the moment. Mm -mm -mm. Aggressive. Be, be aggressive. Okay. So. I now have salt everywhere. Me. Okay. I'm going to try to rip this off without totally ruining it. Unfortunately, their pieces of watercolor paper are already separated. Ta da! Oops. Yay! Ah. Well, screw it. Alright, so this needs to go dry. Let's go think about what it's done. And then. Now, yeah, oopsies. Boop, boop. Where's my mouse? Where'd it go? Boop, boop, boop. So now I think I'm going to do the optical illusion heart, I think. Mm -hmm. And this one is not inspired by an artist, necessarily. I mean, it's inspired by a friend of mine who's an art teacher. So first she, bloop, first she turns this into a square. I don't have to actually fold this. I can cut their paper ahead of time, which I think I might do. So they don't have to, so they don't have to worry about screwing it up. How big is this? 23 centimeters. I just blanked. <clears throat> right. The 
you are nine inches. <clears throat> Easier to be nine inches. So, in theory, that's now a square. A nine by nine square. Let's see. Ten to nineteen. Ten to nineteen. Beautiful. Mm. Um. Oh, did I write on the back of this one? No, I need to make sure I put my name on the back of that one. The children don't try to steal it. No looking. No looking. Okay. So, if I'm not mistaken, the way that she did this with them. Oh, I don't want to watch the video. <sighs> Let's create an- Nope, let's be quiet. Let's not talk at all. Uh, okay. Alright, so she did actually- Alright, I need to fold it in half this way. Corner to corner. That's it. Smoosh all the crayon. Mm. This paper is thick. Alright. So there. Um, it might be a little too thick to do what I need to do, but we're gonna figure it out. So, draw half a heart. La, 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 la. Oh, okay. Alright. Have a heart, okay. Now I gotta figure out what she used to darken. She used pencil. Okay. So. I'm going to cheat. I'm going to use my graphite stick. Okay, so she does all this with marker. Do 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 do. Okay, what is she using there? It's a black crayon to outline your heart. Black crayon. And shade it in. Want to take it a step further? Try painting on top of your lines with some water. Uh, the reason you'll want to do this is because it will help to. Okay. So. We got, hmm. we got half a heart. Yeah, 
It didn't work at all. Hmm. All right, let's try this. So I got this paperweight from my parents' basement. Let's see if that was... Hey, that helped a little bit. That's a start. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to finish drawing the heart. Alright. Hurt. Now. Uh -oh. uh. What I need now are just regular old, hey, look at that, markers. Ta-da! And I'm going to choose to do this in winter rainbow order. I guess I could. Don't fall. Don't fall. Mm. She just heard some rainbow order. I don't know if I want to do it in rainbow order. Like, I want to show them that they have choices. So, what I'm going to do. use every color, right? Mm. What about that? Let's see what they look like on this paper, though. Yes, these are the ones that smell. Or have a smell. So it's going to smell like a fruit salad in here in a minute. What's going on? And then, once I've drawn it all out, see what it looks like when I add water. I don't know if these just don't bleed. I mean, it's possible. Or if I'm just impatient. Well. Try it anyways. So. Let's 
start at the tippy top with this one. I'm just using the lines of my cutting mat. Do all the kids have this to line up with? No. Does it matter? No. Just doing it because I can. And I wrote on myself. Great. Awesome. This is why we <gasps> purple, blue, teal, light green, then dark green. Row, row. I'm gonna try dark green, then the light green. Here I've already screwed up my my pattern. Great. Now here's the real test. What's it gonna look like with the green next to the pink? Ooh. Let's see. It's it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. The kids are project, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if it looks like blue. No one's actually gonna think it looks like poo. Just me. Go to the right on. Ah, because when we hit the heart, we bounce, we bounce. Yep.
bounced. And go straight. I know, I know, I shouldn't do this, but whatever, it's fine. Because I'm not going to let them use marker or few rulers, but that is completely crooked. So. Let's try that. It's starting to do the thing. I think my, my heart's going to be flatter than hers, but whatever. Maybe not. Maybe I can work with the... Uh, um, crayon to add shadow after I finish coloring it with the markers. Manager, maybe. Neat. Yeah, there we go. Okay. When I had to restart everything, I forgot to open up my stream manager. Oops. Hmm. 
dark green. Yeah, I do the dark green and the light green. need to eyeball it and be happy with the results whether I like it or not And the next stripe across, we'll just do one stroke across all of it. So, like, just a little bit. need to accept the fact that it's, the whole thing's not even. And it's not gonna be perfect. Yep, that's a really big stripe of green. Oh well. Let's start with this one. Where's this the right one? Yeah, this is a strawberry. So. Everything's wonky. It's fine. Everything's fine. My hair's on fire, your hair's on fire. Um, not even at all anymore. You know, good talk. There. It's fine. Notice I've gotten progressively <laughs> wider as I've gone. Whoops. <laughs> Thank you. 
Look, these lines started out half an inch, another full inch. Oopsies. Okay. On that one. What comes after pinks? Purple. Mm, this is flying up a little bit. Alright, what came after purple? Dark blue. Oh, thanks for the follow. Terse pond? Terse. Uh, Tersey pond? I don't know. Welcome. Pretty sure I said your name wrong. Feel free to let me know how I'm supposed to say it. Okay. Dark green. <clears throat> Green. Of course the bottom I'm happier with than the top. And then 
I do the bottom one is purple. Dark, dark, dark. <coughs> Excuse me. I could probably do like off my bottom. I have to take a pinch of purple at the bottom. Just, just a tad. Just a touch. A scoosh. A scoosh. There. All right. Now. Show up on the markers. so far. Now, I'm going to get my big brush. My not so clean water. Smoosh, 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 smoosh. Mm. I don't know if that's blending it together or any, but. Mm. Seems to look okay. But it'll make a difference when I get to the heart, though. Or maybe not. I don't know. Just trying to do whatever I can to accentuate that curve.
So I need to let this dry. It won't take very long. Uh, but I need it to dry completely. So let's switch it with this thing. Let's see if this has gotten any better. Mm, it's still wet. You can see the shiny part still. Um, I'm not sure what I wanted to do with it. Oh, I know what I want to do. I want to do the crayon, like darken up the shadows. Maybe I want to do that with the uh, color pencil instead. <laughs> I gotta find color pencil. Ooh. Black color pencil. Let's make thyself new. Ah, oh, here we go. <laughs> okay, let's see. Is this a regular? Uh, no, I think it's a watercolor. That makes me think it's a watercolor because it's got a little paintbrush there. So let me look for another one. <clears throat> Chrome before. Oh. Um, we don't have black in this thing. Mm. Okay, that's probably black. Okay, let's let's see if we get anywhere with this. Just to do. This might be too much for them. Although I could like have it as an option. Like, if you want to learn how to do this, I can show you. But it's not the easiest thing in the world. I wonder if I should go back in and do some like super white highlights. Or is that just doing too much? Might be doing too much. my head back down over. Um, I don't know, what do you guys think? Is that too much? Okay. 
What? It's hard to draw over the salt. So this is still wet. Yeah, kind of. I think the big problem I have with the project example is that they tell you to do the darkest stuff, like the brightest, or no, the darkest on the left, medium, and the lightest on the right. But that still doesn't account for any shadows that you're going to have from overlapping gemstones. Now, I may not be worrying about that at this age, but I don't know. I don't want them to do it and then be like, why does this look weird? Why is it slightly darker on it where it's not where it's hiding in the shadows? Like, well, because the example did it wrong. I think I like the pencil. Because yeah. it is kind of showing depth, but I just wonder if it's making it look. I don't want to make make it look dirty. You know, I got this one little thing, this thing of, I think I've had this for probably two years, and it still has a ton left in it. I do like how some of the salt that's left over is making it look like crystal-ish. Does anybody have kids that tell me whether or not this looks dumb? Specifically, uh, like, nine and ten-year-olds. trying to decide if I want them to practice drawing um, crystals like before they start painting that might not be a bad idea Maybe before they start the big one Oh. Uh. 
something, 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 something. So, crystals. Sure. Can't see my name. Not that you all don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. Um. Did I say what grade these were for? These are for third grade. What? I started putting the grade on the back of these so that I maybe I can remember from year to year. <clears throat> Alright. No, this is not completely dry. However, Let me see how she actually does this shading part. Do, 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 there. Go ahead. Finish. No, stop, 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 stop. That's the part where I actually need to hear you. Sorry. One bump instead of two. Go ahead. Finish. Continue all the way to the bottom. Then use a black crayon to outline your heart and shade it in. Want to take it a step further? Try painting on top of your lines. Okay. So, should give this like shading malarkey. this Kind of a almost like a cross hatching type of situation. It's really hard to see this in real life. Like it's so much easier for me to look at the camera. Which I think is funny. Because I can't be objective. 
it's harder for me to be objective when I'm like looking at it instead of looking straight at the looking at the camera. I don't know, what do you guys think? Does it pop out? Does it look like it's three-dimensional? Does it... Did it work? Do I need to go this way with these? Maybe. the hardest parts about this is that you draw something or you do something and you're like okay I think I got it but now I have to teach a whole bunch of nine eight year olds how to do the same thing or similar and be successful and, and not have them get upset if theirs looks different Baby egos. So fragile. And I don't mean that to be sarcastic. I mean that literally they're. They get so upset if they think that they didn't get it done correctly. Alright. What do you guys think of that? Shadow. I think I'm calling it done. It doesn't look a ton like the one that's on the example, but <clears throat> does it look 3D? Uh, that I can't tell. Whatever. It's fine. Alright, um, I think I need to finish for today because I still need to make something for dinner. And I promised potato soup. So I'm gonna have to find some sort of recipe for easy potato soup. Easy, quick potato soup. Um, potato chowder. Mm. Mm. I don't even know if I have everything. So we'll see. That's obviously white. There, that's better. Um, let's see here. Don't do recipe. So, 
Um, bacon. Maybe. Yellow onion, yes. Garlic, yes. Flour, yes. Chicken broth, yes. Potatoes, yes. Sour cream, yes. Shared cheese, yes. Half and half, no. Salt, garlic powder, onion powder. Okay, no, not this one. Uh, let's see if I can find one with corn. Because I think I have a can of corn. Mmm, potato corn chowder. Mmm, 35 minutes to cook. I think we can handle that. Mmm. Nope, stop it. Stop it. Why did they do. Mm. I hate recipe websites that have all these stupid pop ups. Let's stop it. Onion. Celery. I don't have celery. I don't think. No, I have frozen celery. I know, that's probably cheating. Whatever. Garlic, salt, thyme, pepper, chicken broth, potatoes, corn. Cream. I don't have cream. Mm. I can't have cream anyways. So. Mm -hmm. uh, what? Uh, sugar. Hold on. Sorry. I'm getting messages. I didn't know. Uh oh. Uh. Oh. Mm. All right. Um. Quick potato corn chowder. Looks delicious. How do I jump to? I just want to jump to the recipe. Ooh. I don't like going all the way up. Come on. Um, recipes: butter, yes. Onion, yes. Celery, put in the freezer. Bacon, potatoes, yes. Garlic, yes. Chicken broth, yes. Thyme, yes. Salt, yes. Light cream. What can I use instead of light cream? Can I use sour cream? Can I use Greek yogurt? Hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Corn, olive oil, butter, onion, celery, salt, pepper, thyme, cayenne pepper, broth, potatoes, milk. Well, I think I'll just figure it out. I can just throw stuff in a pot and see what happens, right? <laughs> just like, wing it. Does anyone else wing it when they're making soup? Uh, we have butter, bacon, chopped onion, green, pep green pepper. We do have green pepper. Salt and pepper, minced garlic, flour, chicken broth, potato, carrot, corn, half and half. Everything asks for half and half or cream. I don't want cream. Can I get something? Uh, well, potato corn chowder without. Yeah. Yeah, without dairy. Uh, no, I don't want to use creamer. Without milk. I don't want any milk. Like, I can't have a chowder without milk, can I? It won't let me. The dairy free corn potato chowder. Do do corn bacon medium onion garlic butter flour potatoes stock 
water, bay leaf. It sounds good, but it's not going to work. Do I? Hmm. I can't believe I still have. Okay. So this is going to work. I know this is terribly exciting. Ooh. Smoky vegan clam chowder. Lemon. Mm hmm. Mm. Corn. Stock. Olive oil. Onion. Celery. Bell pepper. Hmm. Sun dried tomato. No, that's not, that's 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 a lot. That's not gonna work. Potato corn chowder that is gluten free. That seems fun. It looks good. All right, let's see. Oil, onion, garlic, corn, potato, broth, flour, Italian seasoning, black pepper. Hmm. I don't know, it looks like I'm going to have to be looking for this for a while. So, uh, thank you all for being here. I'm sure you don't really want to listen to me 